Hello, so for today's video we're going to be unboxing this month's birch box. So this is what May's birch box looks like. This is so cute, I absolutely love this. I say this about all the boxes really don't on, let's be honest. But it comes like a drawer, which I do prefer. So let's jump inside to see what we have. So the first product we have here is from Duce. So this is a Luscious Lip Stain with Mache. Steaming red I got so you had the choice between this and amber rose I just said surprise me because wasn't really sure to be honest but looking at this does this look red to you at all like if I was going to call it steam red it'd be red but we'll give it a swatch just to see what it looks like and stuff so basically it just says wave goodbye to lipstick touch up this pigmented liquid formula applies matte dry spa so it won't transfer onto anything and lasts for hours even better Unlike other matte lip products, this long-lasting formula glides on smoothly for comfortable wear all day. So these retail for £21, which is pretty pricey. Doesn't really have a scent to be honest. So this is what the shade looks like. Um, lip stains, I just, oh, I just can't get on board with. It's like a, it's, mm, the, the problem is with them it's just like oh it's like stained your lips slightly so they look kind of a bit more think no I, I just don't get it i just don't so i mean it's a nice shade and it definitely looks a lot more different than it does in the tube but i'll have to try it out and see how it wears but it doesn't look that pigmented on the back of my hand either but if it is a lip stain then obviously it's not gonna be but yeah that is the first product so the next product we have is from green frog Botanic. so this is geranium and peppermint botanic body wash so it is organic cruelty free vegan and completely free of chemical nasties it also says on the front of here that it has organic aloe vera which sounds really really nice and everything's like plant-based and stuff so this retails for £8.99, which ain't too bad for a body wash, but actually I don't know, like we pay for original sauce, we pay a pound, so £8.99 is quite a hefty price tag really, isn't it? But it does smell actually really, really nice. It just sort of smells like organic, like it just smells like really fresh, which I feel like is really nice. I feel like it makes a good body wash. I have to let you know about this one because I'm not just going to start rubbing it on my body now, but yeah oh zero parabens sal and blah 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 all of that stuff so literally in full blown organic so the next product we have is nated under nerve so this is an active charcoal natural deodorant balm <laughs> so this retails for 7.99 which is pretty hefty for a um deodorant if you ask me so it says, who said you had to rely on harsh chemicals to keep unwanted odours at bay? This all-natural cream foregoes chemicals in favour of the sweat-absorbing, antibacterial, coconut oil and soothing shea butter. Just smooth a pea-side amount onto clean underarms for, for a form of invisible shield. Simple. I'm actually literally going to be right back because I'm actually going to try this out. But to me, picking it up and like rubbing it in my underarms does not sound pleasant. Like, I, I, I don't know. And the jar's like basically half empty as well, like it's not even a full jar, but. Oh, it's nice and soft. It's got like a little bit of a deodorant scent to it. So if it says a pea size, that's literally what I'm going to take. Is that for one underarm? It's just. Oh, I don't. Well, it definitely smell like I put deodorant on. But um, I'll let you know if if I sort of stink up throughout the day or anything. Because I literally had a bath and didn't put deodorant on, so yeah, that was my deodorant. <laughs> so the next product is from Cordell. So this is a makeup removing cleansing oil, which sounds amazing. So this retails for £18, which isn't too bad, to be honest. So you might have tried oils for hydrating your hair and body but what about cleansing your skin this 100% natural blend of sunflower sweet almond and grape oil is a must-have for all skin types just massage just massage onto dry skin to dissolve makeup add water and then rinse away to leave your skin clean and soft i wonder if you can use this on the eye area it'll probably tell you if you can or can't 
Oh yeah, with your eyes closed and like, oh no, no. it says warm between your palms and massage onto dry skin with your eyes closed. That just still doesn't answer my question if I can use it on my eyes, but I'm going to assume that's a no. But um, this actually sounds like really nice. Hopefully it's not too early. I'm actually going to try this tonight. I want to take off this makeup. So I'll let you know in the bottom bar again how this one sort of feels and does. And then the last product is from Lucetta. So this is Lucetta Beauty. So this is a keratin smooth conditioner. So this retails for £19. So let's face it, between curling tongs and changing temperature, it's no surprise that your hair can get a little unruly. Instead of feeling frazzled smooth, Instead of feeling spazzled, smooth this luxurious conditioner through freshly shampooed hair that mints away. It works to strengthen strands from the inside out in locking moisture and boost elect it uh, elect uh, you're, you're having a laugh you being long, I can say this word. Elasticity. So yeah, that actually sounds really, really nice. Um for all hair types. Oh, it's got like a pH balance and stuff. Okay, that's cool. Um Smells kind of nice as well, actually, but I don't know what it is. But when I use shampoo and conditioner, like I have to use the set. Does that make sense? Like, I know, like, they're like, because obviously they convince you that you have to do it. They're like, oh, you have to use it together to get like the perfect results. But I feel like if you do, you do get better results for some reason. But that's probably them putting like messages in my head. So I will try this out. But um, yeah, I really do actually like the sound of that because my hair is like quite dry and. I don't really curl it a lot anymore because when I'm trying to straighten it, when I'm trying to straighten it, when I'm trying to grow it and stuff, it's um, I just I just fry out the window. So yeah, I'm excited to try this one out and see if it like does anything with my frizzy hair as well because my hair is very, very, very frizzy. So yeah, I'm excited for that. Okay, so that was the end of the video. I 